up, Boy Nerdigans? This is the one and only Packer Girl 89. Today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Sakamoto Days chapter 23. So last chapter we found out that um, the lab has been hijacked by um, the X assassin or Assassin X. And it's going to get very interesting now um, because the uh, head of the research lab is about to break out. So. Anyway, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. My name is Asakura. I'm the head of this research lab. Do you want to break free with me? Duh! You're the boss? If you're the boss here, um, uh, then you're the one who had me kidnapped. Uh, no, I didn't. I'm locked up in here with you. What? Are you stupid? Seriously? Okay, then tell me everything you know, mister. And this chapter is titled Asakura and Shin. All right, I'll summarize the important points. This is the lab, um, a covert research institute. I was, um, I was in charge here, but don't know who's running things now. Six days and 13 hours ago, a mysterious armed group took over the facility. From what I've um, overheard, a number of them seem to be assassins. They locked me up down here when I didn't follow their orders. That's it. Then why am I here? I don't get it, mister. How the, how the heck should I know? Who are you even? Oh, now that I think about it, you're the one who mistook me for Shin and kidnapped me. Did you say Shin? Shin the clairvoyant? You know Shin, mister? Do I know him? What? I'm the one who gave Shin his clairvoyant powers. Wait, what? 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 I thought Shin was born that way. Yeah. No, he was just an ordinary bratty little kid at first. It was my research that changed Shin's life. What the fuck? What the fuck? Hey, mister. Um, I hate me. Here, take it. Oh, my God. What? Shin, age six. Um, and there's Asakura, age 25. Magnesium and other nutrients in meat help prevent malnourishment. Get it, you snot nose brat? I hate the meat in the lunches you make because it's all tough and rubbery. Oh, uh, fine. No point in wasting nutrients on an idiot. God, why am I stuck looking after this brat? Ando, you jerk. At the time, I was researching supernatural powers at the lab. An old friend of mine, Ando, left the kid with me and disappeared. Sorry to say, but I'm not good with... I'm just not good with kids. Honestly, I don't even like them. Look at that dopey face. What is he even thinking? Huh? Where's my special smoothie? I need to, um, I needed to focus, um, in the afternoon. Oh, no! Get out, you stupid brat! Um, this is ridiculous. I'm turning into a neurotic parent. <laughs> he is. God, but my research isn't going well. Hey, mister, what you doing? Huh? Oh, I'm researching how to expand the thresholds of brain activity. I'm developing superhuman powers. In other words, I get, uh... I guess it's not surprising you don't get it. Is it fun? Um, ha, is it fun? What could be more fun? For one thing, nobody's ever done it before. It's cool to be the first person to do something, right? No, it's not. Oh, really? Just forget it then. I was going to show you when I succeed. Really? You'd show me? Yeah. Whoa. Shit, it's so, this is so cute. Oh, she gave me a little fight yet. It's so cute. He's right next to him. Oh, this is so cute. Dang, look at him. He's a total wreck. Spending so much time on research that I'll never succeed. I'm jealous that he has so much free time. Yeah, Shin. Um, who are you to say I'll never succeed? Yeah. Then one day, hey, what's this reaction? This is clearly different from anything I've seen before. Could it be? Now to verify it against past da uh, data, let's see. I'm thirsty. Where's that data? Water? Oh no, he drank it! Oh, what are you doing? Oh, Shin, are you okay? He doesn't seem any different. Maybe that the experiment was a failure. Well, it doesn't matter. Um, what matters is the kid's fine. I'm not fine. That stuff tasted terrible, mister. Huh? Did I say that out loud? Um, the experiment was a success. Hey, ta-da! I know what you're thinking. You want to see, uh, Namiki's underwear, right? 
Huh? Uh, and Amiki thinks you're a creep. <laughs> she can read people's thoughts. He was a, he was thrilled by the success of my research. Um, but gradually the other researchers started to avoid Shin. Aww. Hey, anyone want to play with me? Sorry, we're busy. Maybe some other time. Hm. I can't. A guy can't have a private thought around that kid. What a freaky ability. It's kind of scary. I feel sorry for him, but it's disturbing. It was bad luck for Shin. I just... Aww, poor Shin! I just can't relax around him. Maybe I'll take up gardening. I devoted my myself to my research uh, because I believed it would serve humanity, but the results were entirely different. Sheesh. I'm done researching superhuman abilities. Just wait, Shin. I'll make a drug that, that'll that reverse the effects. Don't bother. I'm fine. Your project finally succeeded. Aren't you even happy about it, mister? I'm so sorry I got you mixed up in my stupid research. Your research isn't stupid, mister. I've had enough of this crappy lab, you gloomy scientist. I'm out of here, mister. After that, he left. How can I ever face him? What a sad, what a sad story! I know, right? It's so sad. Sad. But I'm sure Shin doesn't hold it against you. And how would you know? I know because I know Shin. Shin likes his power, and the boss doesn't talk much, so I kind of envy Shin. Huh, boss? But if you still feel bad about Mister, we can apologize to Shin together. Good thing I'm in a fight with Shin right now, too. Article 11 of the Sakamoto fa family rules is, if you get in a fight with someone, make up by the end of the day. It's Shin's new family rule. Yes! Since your apology's kind of late, mister, it might be a good idea to bribe him with a treat. Shin loves cotton candy. Gosh, I'm starting to feel like an idiot. Is Shin taller now, young lady? Um, who's there? See for yourself. Yeah! Oh my god. All right, our escape mission has started. Uh, mission priorities. One, escape. Two, apologize. Oh, okay. Am, am I going to die? No. You're not going to die, Tanaka. But this was cute. Like, I feel so bad. Now you, you can understand why Shin feels the way he does about, about people, especially in the lab. Like, they were pricks. Even the, even the scientist was a prick. But the thing that's great about Sakamoto is Sakamoto, uh, like, because he's so, because he's quiet and he's silent all the time, Sakamoto, um, Shin's power is actually useful because, like, he can plan shit with Sakamoto. And Sakamoto, I think he, Sakamoto appreciates that with Shin. Shin's power is useful for, um, for assassin jobs. It's fucking useful as hell but anyway i'm really curious what you guys think and the other thing is is we have like these other people that have these superhuman abilities involved as well um including um we've seen the guy with the that turns invisible and shit so i wonder that's got to be what they're after right the assassins group's got to be after that shit Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys thought of this chapter. Um, do you, are you guys, like, your heart's gotta break for Shin, especially. Because he's the, he's the victim in all of this. He is. He's the victim in this whole situation. Anyway, um, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Sakamoto Days content, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to, to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist, all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, friend me on PlayStation Network, that's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.